Hi everyone, welcome to Linda's 50 Live and welcome to Tea Tuesday. And if you're watching this on Wednesday, it's because I'm a day late, as always. <laughs> I was going to film this yesterday and I was so tired. My brain just wasn't working and I started to film and it was just like nothing was that was coming out of my mouth was making sense. So we just put it off until this morning. I got a good night's sleep. So the first thing I want to share is that I'm <clears throat> I'm drinking Sweet Cinnamon Spice by Tezo. Uh, <clears throat> it's a herbal infusion of warm sweet cinnamon and spicy star anise. And I am not sure who sent this to me, but thank you. I think it was Janet Kay. So <clears throat> today I am drinking out of, you're going to love this, <laughs> my tiger mug. <laughs> when Tiger was a baby, I found this little mug. It's got tigers on both sides of it. And um, when we would make milk coffee, when he would spend the night, which he doesn't do anymore, he's too big. <laughs> he might one of these days, but right now he doesn't spend the night at grandma's. Um, anyway, he would, um, we would make milk coffee and he would just drink it out of, this was his special mug. And uh, it's a bone china made in England. And I just think it's adorable. So one of these days I'll give it to him, but I am drinking out of it today. That is just so cute. <clears throat> oh, I hope you're all doing well. I am finally feeling a little better. I noticed in my last video, I kept sniffing. <laughs> And I was like, oh, I'm so embarrassed by that. And I might do that again today, but I have my trusty Kleenex. My nose has just been run away. I think it's just allergies. And my face is all broke out with my eczema. I am just, but everything is good. Good, good, good. So I wanted to share with you and um, that Kimberly Cochran sent out these adorable um, give thanks postcards to many, many of us on YouTube. It is adorable and has the cutest little message on the other side. And I just love it. And I am putting it in my gratitude journal, which I am all done with because it's um, November 30th or December 1st, depending on which day you want to pretend you're watching this <laughs> So we're going to say it's the end of November. I have so enjoyed doing my gratitude journal and I am looking forward to starting my December daily. And to those of you who joined me and encouraged me to do this, thank you so much. I, I put little cards and tags and things that you had sent me um, in, the, in the pockets. Really, really had a good time. And so speaking of gratitude, on the last Gratitude Sunday, I had a surprise giveaway. And the giveaway is for this gratitude and prayer and praise journal. And I had 12 people who left a comment with the word grateful or gratitude in it. And the lucky winner is... Da -dum, da -dum. Wanda, a day in my world. I am so excited for you, my friend. I think you will really enjoy this and the coloring and, and the different things. You know, get your girls involved with you. They, they might like to color with you. So I will be getting that out to you in the mail. And thank you so much, all of you. And I am looking forward to December. And I hope that um, many of you will join in with me and we will share some Christmas memories and gratitude. So, and another thing for Tea Tuesday is look at this adorable ornament. It is a little spode teacup and it has this ribbon. Isn't it so cute? So I will be hanging that on my tree as, um, as a reminder of Tea Tuesday, which I have enjoyed so much this year. And so I want to give a big thank you to Patty at Patty's Life and Kathy's um, Favorite Things for hosting this. It's just been so much fun just to pop on on a Tuesday or Wednesday and, <laughs> and share tea and chat with you. So, oh, so... 
um, I want to finish up the saga of mom's Christmas tree. So, you know, I bought a Christmas tree. It was too big, so I took it. I gave her my little old tree, and it is a scraggly little thing, and she didn't like it. So she wanted to try her old tree, and her old tree, half the lights wouldn't light up. So I bought a string of lights, and then she said no. And so... <laughs> She found a three-foot tree at a Walmart about 30 miles away, and I said, I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it, and it was a beautiful day, and I enjoyed the drive, and I went, and I got her the, I got her the Christmas tree, and it was, it was, she's happy with it. It's not as full and pretty as the one she's had for over 10 years, but I said, you know, they just don't make them like they used to unless you want to spend a fortune, and she does not. So her tree is up. She took off all the bows and the bulbs from the other one. And I am just so glad that mom has a Christmas tree. Now, I thought mom had a Christmas tree a couple of different times, but no. But this time she has a Christmas tree. So um, I, I, uh, 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 sorry. So I am excited to start um, my December daily, and I will be back later with that, and I thank all of you so much for uh, joining me, and I will talk to you soon. Bye now.